This is how I got to be one of the biggest and the most ripped guy back when I was in high school without ever stepping foot into a gym. So I was 16 years old and I just got transferred to this new high school and over there they were mostly teaching sports. And I got to play handball on a very high level and I wanted to be the best, I wanted to give everything to be the best player that I can be. So. One of the things I started to do, because also I was living in a dorm room with other students and other players and stuff like that, uh, every single evening after dinner, I used to go in the shower room and I remember there were all these pipes hanging out from the wall and I was climbing these pipes and I started to do pull-ups. So pull-ups mostly like that, underhand. And after I was doing as many as possible, I was dropping down and I was doing push-ups as many as I could. And I used to do that for around one hour. And I remember, this is quite funny, that when I started, I was the only one doing it. But after a couple of weeks, some of my colleagues um, from this building saw me and they started to join in. So after a couple of months, we were actually around eight to 10 uh, guys just pumping every single evening, which was really, really cool. And you can see already a parallel with uh, the profession that I have now that I inspired others to, you know, train and get better, become a better version uh, of themselves. So I was doing this for maybe one year and a half, two years, and I could see really good results. But I was doing it every single evening, every single day without missing. Of course, if I had to go to play a game um, in another city or something like that, maybe then I would miss it. But when I was home, you know, I was doing it every single evening without missing any opportunity to do that. So um, after like two years, when I was maybe 17 and a half, almost 18, uh, I was in my last year of uh, high school and I was ripped, you know, I will try to find a picture. I had, you know, good chest, I had a good set of arms, I had a good uh, back and good shoulders and everyone, and absolutely everyone thought that I'm going to the gym. Even my colleagues who were going to the gym and, you know, they were doing it a couple of times uh, per week, they were surprised and they were like, where are you going to the gym? Stop lying to us because we are sure you are going to the gym. And the truth was that I was not going anywhere. It was pure mad dedication. Day in, day out, I was doing my push-ups, I was doing my pull-ups, I was grinding, I was going until failure on every single set, so I was pushing myself. I was surprising, even though I didn't have the best nutrition, not because um, I didn't want it, but just that was the condition back then. I didn't, I cannot say, I had the best nutrition because I was eating at this canteen with all the other students. So I was basically eating like everyone else, which was not a lot and I was constantly, almost constantly, you know, hungry. Uh, but this is a very valuable lesson to be learned. So a lot of the times you may have the best scenario, the best gym, the best nutrition, the best uh, coaches, the best everything, you know, and you still cannot get results because it's not there. Once it's there, you know, and once you really, really want it, you will do everything in your power to get better, everything in your power to get the workout in, everything in your power to become better every single day. So, even though I was, as I said, um, didn't have the best conditions, but I give my best with what I had. So, Nowadays, I see all these people complaining, oh, I don't have this, I don't have time, I have this and the other. It doesn't matter, you know, just do your best because you have so much power in your hands. You just have to use it. It doesn't matter where you are. It doesn't matter if you don't have the best conditions, but you can still make it work and you can still be great. That dedication is gonna bring you results. All right, guys, that was my story. I hope it will motivate you to push yourself and get better, get healthier, get stronger. Yeah, wherever you are, wherever you want to achieve, it is possible if you put your mind into it. So thank you so much for watching. I hope you enjoyed the video. Please hit the subscribe button, the thumbs up button, and I shall see you in the next video. Ciao, ciao.